Hi everyone. Today I will be discussing about what is pattern steel distillation and how it works. So what is pattern steel distillation? Pattern steel distillation is also called a column steel distillation, continuous steel distillation and a coffee steel distillation. This is a type of steel which is used to produce gin, vodka, white rum and whiskies. And Irish distiller name uh, NS Coffee patented this distill in 1831. And this still produces pure and cognitive free alcohol. And this still is much cheaper to operate than the pot steel distillation. So, as you know, in pot steel distillation, you need to heat it up to 78 degrees Celsius, and then vapors are cooled down in condenser and collected in order to get the ethyl alcohol. And this process must be repeated. And this process completes one distillation in three steps, but in pattern steel distillation, this long process is not required. So this is also called a continuous steel distillation. Now I will describe you how the pattern steel works. Now you can see the picture of pattern steel distillation, which is uh, analyzer and a rectifier. And all columns are vertically structured that are divided into sections. These all are divided with the perforated plate. So, what is perforated plate? Perforated plate is a type of plate which you can see in the picture. This type of plate is a type of plate which has a small hole and helps the wash to drip down to the underneath and helps the vapor to come upside. That is perforated plates and see so that plate these all are that perforated plates each of this column uh, analyzer and the rectifier comes with the perforated plate see these all are perforated plate these all sections are divided with the perforated plates What is the use of this analyzer? This analyzer is to uh, is used to segregate the alcohol from water and send it to the rectifier. Send it to the rectifier from here. Then the rectifier's job is to rectify the spirit alcohol and at the same time to condense the alcohol vapor into liquid. Now I will explain you how this pattern still works. So the cold wash, this is a fermented cold wash, this is fermented juice, you can say fermented juice and uh, how it works, see this fermented juice will enter through this pipe uh, from the rectifier, this pipe and while coming down the wash is getting uh, heated up, the more it comes down the more it get heat because this part uh, this part of the this one spirit plate till this spirit plate this part of this pipe is cold and this part of this pipe is hot because um, this cold fermented liquid enters through this pipe so still uh, till this part this uh, pipe is cold and this part of the rectifier is hot so the cold was entered through this pipe and the wash is pumped the wash is pumped uh, Pump to the analyzer column and the wash flows down through the perforated plates through this plate through down perforated plate and while coming down it reaches to the boiling point which create alcohol vapor and this vapor pass through a tube that leads to the rectifier it means once it reaches to the boiling point the vapor will start uh, going upward through this hole and it will pass through this pipe and that leads to the rectifier and the alcoholic vapor that has reached to the rectifier will start moving upward through the perforated plate and hits this pipe hits this pipe that is carrying cold wash change in temperature cause the alcohol vapor to condense and change in liquid and will end up going to the uh, spirit receiver this is liquid spirit spirit receiver so this is also called a distillate spirit and the remaining vapor will go to the head this side and is collected and sent back to the analyzer for the distillation again so this is how the pattern still works thank you for your time so i'll be back with the new exciting videos 
to see this type of video please do like subscribe to my channel so you can see the upcoming videos please